sponsor, Todd. You need, get, you need to get a new sponsor for that or something. Oh, no. <laughs> sponsor your show. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, Todd is cool. Todd and Mark, no, they make, they make straight man sex toys. Right, so you can start your own line. Yeah. Do you have much money in that, by the way? Oh, I wish I could. They're called G Spot, like, like simulators. They're for straight men. They're not even for gay men. They make G Spot simulators for straight yes. men. Yes. Because, yep. because that's not gay. It's not gay anymore at all. It's because it feels good. And the thing the, is, a man, a man is a man is a man. The anatomy works the same, no matter if you're gay or straight. Exactly. It's the same. Come on, so, come on, come on kind of class. You're really, you're really plastering it on thick here. You, you know just as well as I do. <laughs> 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 Todd, you know, like this. Todd is fucking out of the world right now. Because you know what he's saying. No, this is the, this is the most this is the most he's ever, as far as I know, been ever able to talk about anything sexual for more than like two minutes without falling off of his chair. It's always like, oh my god, oh my god, I can't talk about this. And like, oh my god. So I'm actually proud that he's actually been able to stand the conversation. So anyway. yeah, I, I, I'm just in shock. That's that's probably why I am a part of this conversation. I will probably speak <laughs> tomorrow in, in, in pain and agony knowing that I have heard <laughs> such such disgusting things tonight on this program. <laughs> did Kings of Talk did Kings of Talk just like get like disgusted and like hang up or did he say goodbye or not? No. No, I don't think he did. Okay, I didn't think so. I was just like I realized he wasn't there anymore, so yeah, okay. I was just curious. All right. Yeah, well, some people don't uh, handle the, the the prostate massage process <laughs> conversation. Oh, oh, Todd, 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 Todd. <laughs> do you have Google? Todd, do you have Google? Yes. Oh God, there, I can't handle that. Oh, there, Todd, no, you have no, I cannot. There is no way in hell oh, my, yeah, my computer. <laughs> look up, look up G mail G G spot for males for straight guys. Bullshit. Which is just the prostate. That's all yeah. it is. That's all it is. That's all it is. And you can hit yeah. it through. You can hit it through between, like, not hitting into your ass. No, I, have, I have no G spots. No, you do. You do. No, you do. That's the thing. That's the thing. I want to hit you know, every spots, time, but I don't, I don't see anybody hitting it. Every time, every time that you have to, every, every, every time you have sex, the prostate is what makes you feel the orgasm. Exactly. Every single time. And and there, and all that and, and, exactly. And there is a way to make it without you you can literally bust without even being like hard at all. You can bust without even yep. being hard. It's it's, it's, yep. it's it's what? Stupid. It's stupid. It's dumb. It's ridiculous <laughs> how this thing works. You can what it's, it's too, that's way too advanced for him, Tyson. You can't go that far. He's <laughs> too advanced for him. <laughs> He's gonna <laughs> he just needs to. The fact he's he talked about it, that's all he needs for today. It's just to like he, he's actually made it progress and discuss it. So that's cool. <laughs> he can he'll be okay for a while. That's probably no, talking no. about prostates. So no, 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 <laughs> no prostates, please. Oh my God! Imagine the See, that's, the, that's the perfect guy you're here. That that's like the fucking Voldemort of words for old straight men. Like they think that is such a bad word and they don't even understand what they're missing out on. And there is going to be a huge generation of men that are going to miss out on a incredible experience of their lives because they think, they think in their own minds that that makes them gay. And if they think in their own minds that makes them gay, then that, that means that they're self-conscious about something. I mean, me as a straight man, that has a girlfriend that I love, absolutely, that told her to do something like that, I am incredibly happy that I can enjoy that. Like, there is other people that are, like, so self-conscious about themselves thinking that they're gay or thinking that they their friends might think they're gay, that they won't do that because they're too afraid to think that other shit. And they're missing out on an incredible experience because society thinks that that makes them gay. And that makes the person think that them, their own self is gay, and that's just ignorant. Why is Stabby? Okay. Why is Stabby? Is Stabby pissed at you or something? Or is he always like this towards you, Todd? 
have no idea. Stabby has been. He says he says you he says life. you deserve ass cancer essentially. <laughs> <laughs> Not cancer, but being mean to. Oh, okay, oh, okay, gotcha. I see. Stabby. Well, that's good to know. Because I don't think I would ever wish cancer on anybody, even somebody I can't stand, like Baltimore. Not even, even ever, wish cancer on anybody. It's a horrible. Thing. I would wish cancer on Hitler. Which I wouldn't wish it on him wait, because. Wait, 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 wait. Which Hitler was your your officer in a past life? So I do wish yeah. cancer on your officer in a past life. Oh well, thank you. I appreciate that. I do. <laughs> I appreciate that so much. I, I complete. I completely listened to your last show, and I know everything about that last show, and I completely listened to it all. I don't remember which show it was, but I know it was last, last it was, week. Um, I think. It was. It was last week, or maybe a little bit, like a week and a half ago. You were talking about your okay. psychiatrist, not your psychiatrist, but your um, psychic. Psychic. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you were you were yeah. a uh, Nazi in your last life, and that's why yeah. you are your life right now. You that's why you are a homosexual that's black. That is not going no, to be no, 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 no. I'm a biracial homosexual. That's like yeah, calling yeah, yeah. pisses me off when but, people say but, that, man. But, but that's what you said. That's what you said on your last show. That's why you are. No, a I never, I never reflect here. myself as black. I never reflect yeah, myself yeah, yeah, as know. white you, either. You said, you you said you you are a homosexual that is half black, which is yeah, which is a race that is hated by most people in the whole entire world. Which I don't hate, yeah. but I'm saying that, that it, that's a realization. Most people do not like blacks. Yep, that's true. That's very true. Well, I think that um, I don't think that it's so much <laughs> that people don't like black people. I think that it's that they that they have been conditioned to I mean they don't like them, you're right, some of them don't. But they've been conditioned by their societal by society in that they live in like they live in the South, they live in Texas or wherever they live. Yeah, to yeah. look at black people as being less there's than there's, there's, anybody there's else. Certain, no, there's certain black people that you can tell are good and there's certain black people that you can tell are not. I mean well, what's the same way with white people. It's the same way with white people, it's that way with Asian people, it's that way with every race. This is gonna sound with, with white people and Asian people and every single race, but this is gonna sound fucked up with Every single gay black guy I've ever heard of does not turn out to be a fuck up. They turn out to be good unless they're in jail. That's, the, that's not true. <laughs> that's so not true. That's because you don't know enough black gay guys or whatever <laughs> kind of gay, gay guys to know. There are plenty. Of, there are plenty of there are plenty of black gay guys who turn out to be fuck ups. Trust me, that I have and they exist, and I've known them. Trust me. So that's not true. It's not because they're gay that they're all of a sudden just wonderful and perfect because the black is such a horrible part. That's a ridiculous thing to say. They are not just wonderful because they're gay, and that's somehow mitigated the fact that they're black. Being black is not a curse. Being part black is not a curse. Being any race that's not white is not a curse. I don't see the white race as superior to any other race. I don't see the black race as superior. I see race as equal because race oh – God, I have the whole show. You should listen to my show about race instead. The whole show I have is about how race is an illusion and the fact is race doesn't even fucking exist. And the fact that people even pay attention to race is ridiculous because they're looking at something that we as human beings have made up. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think all races are equivalent. I think – That's because, that's because you've been conditioned I, not to believe that. That's why well, no, 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 you're not told, listen, you've been conditioned by think, you've been conditioned think, by society every, to believe that every, Caucasian the Caucasian race is better. Oh no 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 no! I think every single yeah, race. I think I think the blacks. The I I've been conditioned. I have been conditioned but, to believe that because of media. Because my mom's side is Caucasian, and so I grew up with her entire side of the family, not the other side, and so that's well, all I knew. So I know how people are conditioned in in any in the white race, in the other race as well, being around them all the time. So I understand even people like myself have been conditioned to believe that. I don't believe that, but I've been conditioned that way by society and media and everything else to believe that. So it is true that I've been conditioned to believe that the white race is better because that's what every textbook says, history books, and everything else. Hello? That's not what I think. I think... I think, saying you, I think, no, no, no. Let me just say that's not let you talk. Let me just say that's not let you talk. I don't think that you think that. I'm not saying think that. I'm just saying you've been conditioned to believe that by society. I'm not saying you agree with it necessarily. I'm just saying you've been conditioned by society and everything in the media, etc., leads you to think, they're tell, to tries to tell you 
that that's true, even though it's not. That's what I'm trying to say. Well, yeah, I, I, I absolutely know that's not the truth. But I do think that all the white, the Hispanic, the Native American, I, I mean, me, myself, I'm Native American myself. I'm very tan. I'm a fucking, I'm not white. I think the whites, the, the blacks, the Spanish people, they're all the same. But I think the, the, the Asian people, I think the Asian people are on a different level than everyone else. I think the Asian people are brought up different than everyone else, and I think the Asian people are smarter than everybody else. And but do you know that that has nothing to do with their race? And that has nothing to do with their race. That has to do with their culture, which is exactly, separate exactly, from their that's, race. That's exactly, exactly. And what it has to do with their culture, but the culture of the Asian people is Asian. There's no fucking culture that is brought up like Asian people that are white, black, or Hispanic. The Asian people are brought up... Well, why would they be? Face. They're not Asian, so why should they be? Okay. So what do you think well, is superior well, about them? The fact that they, the way they, they work so hard? What I'm saying kind of is the, the, the Asians are people that work harder and better than any other race in the world. They do. Okay. I'm not, I'm not Asian well, myself. Know. I'm Asian yeah. American and white myself. Uh-huh. And I think, well, I think I, that that's true. I understand that they work very hard. They work themselves to death. There's actually a a term called eh, katakawa or some shit like that. I can't exactly. remember. It's exactly. in Japan, that's what I'm in Japan exactly. where they work themselves to death, literally. And so, yes, but I don't think that's, I don't think that, that I don't think that that's anything to actually emulate. I don't think working yourself to death is a good trait. Yes, they're hard workers, but there are plenty of people who are hard workers who are not Asian. So that's not true. <laughs> I don't well, 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 I'm not saying that's not true, but I think the Asians as a whole group are harder workers than the rest of the world. Okay, you can say that if you think so. I don't disagree with you, but that's fine. I, okay. I, I have to think so because look at the rest of the world. What does the rest of the world produce? And then look at what the uh, world Hello, is. you're living – you're not paying attention to all of world history here. Do, China – Hello, China, Japan, that whole area uh, uh, yeah, area of the world was practically in the dark ages until almost the 900s. Oh, the no, only no, reason, no, no, no. The only reason you're yeah, seeing yeah. what you're seeing yeah. now, the only reason oh, you're I, seeing what you're seeing yeah, now yeah. is because of what has happened to our economy in the United States, and they exactly. have siphoned hey, off exactly. our economy. That's, that, that's, that's what the problem is, is. Our economy has made it easy for our Americans to make it easy for our lives. But the Asian economies have not made it easy for the the, the low-bred fucking feed-off-the-government Asians. So all the Asians are working. You have any Asian kid that goes to high It's a communist. You're area. talking about China. It's communist, though. You can't but, compare no, I, that. I, I of know, course I they're going to have a better... They're going to have exactly, more production yeah, in a communist yeah, country. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. But all I'm saying is the Asians right now are... are they're the best race in the world right now. If there is a best race, okay, if, if there, that's quite a statement. If there, is, if there is a best race in the world, there's Asians, not whites, not blacks, not Hispanics, but it's Asians. Asians are the best race in the world to be. I don't, I don't. You see, I don't agree with you because you're saying you're basing everything you're talking about is based on culture, like I said earlier. And yes, you're you're tying it to their race because they're an Asian. It's the Asian culture you're discussing. I understand that, but it's not the fact that their race is superior. It's the fact that you believe their culture is superior. So you should say culture, not race. Exactly. Exactly. And that's it. Well, let, me, let, me, let me say this first, because the reason is this, is this, look, listen, 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 if you had a white person, if you had a white person, if you had a white person or a black person or a Hispanic person, in the same culture, it would be the same thing. Anybody could do it. Anybody could do it. I agree with you. Anybody could do it. A white person could do it. A black person could do it. A gay person could do it. A straight person could do it. A Spanish person could do it. A fucking person that lives under the ocean could do it. The only people that are fucking doing it are the Asian people right now, and that's what makes them the superior race right now. That's what makes them the well, superior race because they're the ones could, that are doing it. 
you could say that, okay i i think you're extrapolating things way out and on what they actually are i just i understand what your argument is and i agree with it to an extent i just don't necessarily agree with it all the way but you could take like i said any race and put them in the same culture and they would have the same type of production so yes i would say that's why i'm saying to you i think you should distinguish between race and culture because you're talking about their culture not their race you're saying that their race is superior when it's not their race that you're discussing you're